some viewers may find the following video disturbing. Viewer discretion is advised. Well, hello and welcome back to the channel. In today's video, we find ourselves in Medford, Oregon, where a sovereign citizen has been gaining a real reputation for driving under a suspended license in his mother's car. And in this latest traffic stop, he asks for a supervisor, but it doesn't exactly go the way he thinks, and he ends up getting his mother's car towed. So let's sit back, relax, and enjoy the show. I cross over the I don't have license or insurance. I have none of those contracts. Okay, I don't okay, contract. I don't have none of those contracts. Okay. Now it makes me wonder, if he believed in his cause so much, why isn't he risking the impoundment of his own car rather than the impoundment of his mother's car? I mean it really doesn't make any sense in this case. I don't do no contracts. I don't have no contracts. I have a free right to travel. Okay, what's your first name? I don't answer none. Can I get a supervisor? Can I get your first name? Can I please get a supervisor? Okay, so here's the thing I'm gonna explain to you. If you feel presenting carry, that is a crime. Right now, all I have is traffic violations. All right, well, I don't have no license. I don't have none of those contracts. I don't do none of Do you of have those. a name? You guys know who I am, man. This is like a repeated thing all the time. Oh, look who's so self-absorbed with their own narcissism that they can't even get their head out of their own ass to realize that not every cop knows who you are, and they probably don't care. Do you have no insurance? This is not my car. This is my mother's car. Does she have insurance? Uh, this is all her stuff. I'm pretty sure she has everything she's supposed Can to have. Can you grab me the proof of insurance, please? I know it's Wawanisa. I'm sorry, I can't hear you with the cars passing by. It's all Wawanisa. I know she has it though. This might be on her phone. It's Walwanisa. You need me to call and get her out here? I do this all the time. You can call her and have her send you a picture of your parents. Yeah, your mother is going to really love you for this, considering that she never gave you permission to drive her car to begin with. And we'll find that out in the court hearing later on. For you, just that way, uh... Don't have one. Okay. Don't have one. So you're seizing my personal right. property. So that's what you're doing, right, Quintero? With no crime, no nothing committed. I just need this on recording. You're going to seize my personal property. Can you're I seizing my personal I... property, which violates my constitutional okay. rights. So you don't have an address? I'm just asking a question. I need you to say this because you took an okay. oath. You took a constitutional oath, and I'll go get a copy of your oath, you. and plus your charter, which you, protects my common law rights. Do you have a I'm just asking you, can you please get a supervisor, Quintero? Can forward any mail Quintero, mail can you please get a supervisor? Because I know my constitutional okay. rights. You, you can't take my address? property without a proper, uh, you can't take it without a crime. A crime underneath ORS 106.065. Wow, talk about soft, tired, and incompetence at its height, citing a penal code that doesn't even exist, while completely ignoring others that do, because you do need a driver's license in every freaking state of the union. So I'm just going to go start on this side. All right, go start on it. I'm just right. glad I got it. So you're what taking my personal property with no crime being committed and without due process. What stuff do you need out of the car? Just so without due process out. and my personal property, right? What stuff do you need out so of the car? So you're taking it, right? Yes, I'm going to take the car. All right, thank you. That's all I need okay. to record. So I need and you, you took it off to that, right? I need to step out. Where all right, you can you call my supervisor? Property. I don't feel safe stepping out with you. Thank you. I don't feel safe with you at all. And here comes the supervisor, 
but he's not going to help this soft heart out anyway. So let's get on with the video. Uh, have I done something wrong? Yeah, you know you're suspended, right? Uh, yeah, yeah and I'm, right. I'm not suspended. I've never done any of those contracts. You guys know it's my constitutional right to travel. I'm not in okay. no commerce, you and I have a right license. to travel. I'm going to court, and I'm already, I'm already challenging all of that. So all of my stuff, and you're not allowed to profile like that. This is the second time what? I got you recorded following you me. Have a I got you following license. twice following me. Yeah. So I know this okay. is going on towards my lawsuit. Okay. Suspended license. All right, going towards my drive. lawsuit. I have a constitutional okay. right, just like an oath you signed. No. No. Okay. Yeah, it's okay. underneath your constitutional oath that you signed. Okay, you cannot drive in Oregon. You have, you have a constitutional oath to uphold. You do. Okay. And as long as your constitutional oath is put mm -hmm. on record, mm -hmm then therefore you could be liable. So you could take the car and that's my personal property okay. and you yourself, Mr. Grisham, mm -hmm. will be liable for my personal property okay. as the other officers are going to be liable too for my personal property. Okay. Oh boy, you gotta love the stupidity of this guy quoting statutes that don't exist while ignoring others that do, especially the one statute that proves him wrong in this particular conversation. Man, you just can't make this stuff up. So I have a constitutional right. I've never, ever, ever done any of those contracting. I've never contracted. I'm trying to get out of all of the rest of my contracts. All contracts. I don't deal with contracts. I'm a God-living individual and I have a free right to travel. So we've done this over and over and over. So, <clears throat> and... It's not even unlawful. You can't arrest for a misdemeanor. So that's against the law, too. I've been doing a lot of research. Yeah, you wouldn't know what real research would be anyway. I mean, you probably looked into a website that was run by uh, King Softard himself, Chili de Castro, which is quite a worthless site to get any information whatsoever if you want to stay out of jail. Do you have an ID or insurance? I don't have any of that. I just bought the car. I don't have any of the things that will make me in compliance with that contract. Contract? I have no contracts. This is my mother's property and I'm using it. It's okay. my mother's property. Suspended driver's license? No I'm insurance? Okay, well, Are you I'm ready telling you owner? now. My mother's car. This is my mother's okay. car. This is okay. her property. Okay. So I don't know what you're asking me for. I don't have to identify myself because I haven't committed a I crime. Know who you are. You've already falsely ran my name. So go ahead. That's all. That's all stacks. That's all. That's you all have charges. Zero idea what you're talking I'm, about. Okay. This cop is right. This idiot has no idea what he's talking about. This soft hard is a an example of Dunning Kruger at the very finest. Okay, I Do promise you, you can't be held. For what? I haven't committed no crime. We're towing your vehicle because you're driving for what? with no insurance. You can't just tow yes, my private property. Yes, I can. How can you just tow I my private told property? You. I told you, you have, you have a suspended driver's license. <clears throat> you have no insurance. You know you have none of those things. You know you're not supposed to be driving. You are <clears throat> driving on the roadway. Multiple places I saw you. You even have a reason for pulling me over? You are suspended. Uh, besides targeting. So no, basically no. saying that you car. think you know me. Get out of the car. You think you know me, so that's the reason why you're pulling me over. Is that what you're saying? Can you call your sergeant out here, please? I'll call him out here. Please. As soon as you're compliant. Please, I am compliant. Yeah. I'm asking you nicely. Please so call your sergeant because I believe turn I'm not turning off. my... I'll turn my car off. Thank you. My car ain't... There you go. But there okay. you go. Okay. My personal property, I'm putting yep. it in my pocket. All my keys. My personal property. So... Can you please call your sergeant? 216 at 211, where are you coming from? <sighs> and I do have a constitutional right to travel. And it's been upheld by all your Supreme Courts and everything. 216 to San Juan. Citation needed for those cases that you say support your uh, idea that people can drive on the public roads with no driver's licenses. Because I sure as hell haven't seen them. I've never even had a license. Sergeant, I've never had a license in my life. Okay. So I don't even know how they can suspend something I never had. Because when you drive and consistently... I have a right to travel. Okay. Be, I'm being honest, Clarence, Sergeant. I don't have a right to travel. I'm not, asking you. Not in a motor vehicle on the roadways. No. I don't have a... My, uh, this is private property. I don't have okay. a right to travel so on private property. on the roadway. On on pri no, on pri that's all private road. It's this... 
This is called premises open to the public. Okay. And you're still it's not- It's all public road. I'm going here just to buy something. I'm not doing no commerce. Okay. I don't work. You guys make sure that. Fair. You guys show up to my work too. Fair. You guys there, showed up to my work time. I was selling drugs there. So anything Claire, else, man? Is there any specific reason why you requested me over here? Enough is enough. Time to get him out of the car and tow the vehicle. All he's going to do is repeat the same script over and over again. He has nothing new to say. Yeah, because he talking about towing my car. I've done nothing wrong, and I have a right to keep my personal property. Claire. Unless I committed a crime Claire. or done something wrong, there's no valid Claire. reason to tow my car. Claire. You don't have insurance on the vehicle, and there's no registration. I haven't any. shown nothing. I ain't shown no paperwork because on this vehicle because I feel like I don't have a right. I don't have okay. to. Okay. Do you have insurance on the vehicle? This is not my vehicle. It's my mother's okay. vehicle. So and yes, yeah, she has insurance. She has everything for the vehicle. She Clarence. just got it done. Clarence. So that's that. Clarence. You could call her. Okay. You can call her. You okay. Can, well, I have a right. I have a right to travel. You mean Clarence. tell me I don't? Hey. Just tell I'm, me I don't, Olive. I, I don't have a right to, to travel in my own personal property. The right to travel has nothing to do with motor vehicles. It has everything to do with the right to travel between states and be treated equally as if you are a citizen of that state. And of course the Constitution, which you claim to know so much about, has the Tenth Amendment, which grants the states the right to create laws that are not covered in the Constitution. When are you softards gonna learn that? I just explained to you. You have okay. to have a valid license. And I've never done any of those contracts. Or premises open I have to the done public. none of those contracts. Okay. I have You're a free, free to right walk to travel, travel anywhere. You anywhere. Want. I have okay, a right to travel anywhere. Yeah, as a passenger. No. Not as a driver. As a driver. No, I have a right to a travel anywhere. No, okay. Yeah. So I'm just saying, man, why, why is this like, over, what Claire. is this whole thing? Why Claire, is this hey, going to be a key consistent Claire. thing? It don't matter if I hey, walk or not. I'm Oliver. trying to talk to you. Okay, Apparently, but go ahead. I mean I could put Now this is where the video stops. I don't know why you decided to stop it right here. But the vehicle does get towed because there is a video of a court hearing where uh, they were discussing the validity of this particular tow and his mother was not too happy with him. Well, I hope you enjoyed the video and thanks for watching.